Chris yep. Archer making his 24th appearance. His seventh start as a Pirate, and by far his best was Saturday. This is the official stretch position. And that is an official strikeout, and it'll make it official in the toss to first to complete the K. And the strikeout, back-to-back -back Ks. Yes, sir. Struck him out looking. Chris Archer strikes out the side in order to start the ball game. Dan Stralian, don't take him for granted. He has had a couple good starts last two times out. 14 game winner two years ago for the Cincinnati Reds. High fly ball to right. Got mm. under it. That ball would have been in the river. That was a very impressive high pop up. Just missed. Popped up right side. Bell. Makes the catch. Last night, uh, fundraiser. And that is inside the third base bag, and that'll be a double for Corey Dickerson. It's drastically now. And the drive hit well to center field, sending Brinson back to the wall, and there it is. Finally, ring that bell. His first home run since August the 11th. And that was the last time he drove in a run. And the shallow center drops for the hit. And the only reason a run has not scored is because the pitcher is running at second base. Starlin Castro's base hit would have produced a run otherwise. A little tapper. Archer gets the out. And yes, he did. He offered that pitch well out of the zone for the strikeout. Love one of the game watching Barry Bonds and a base hit. There it is. All right. Kevin Kramer. His first major league hit is a solid single to right. Yep, mom, dad, the whole crew. Well, that's another box I can check off. Souvenir baseball. Mom, so proud. Yep. Dad's got the quiet pride. Mom gets emotional. Yeah. That's the way it works. That's the way it should be, huh? Yep. That never goes away. That is forever. Another high pop. And that'll do it. Can they get to? Well, he takes a long time before unloading it, but he knew he had time. Archer. Into right center in the second. And Chris Archer fired up there. Strikes out his fourth. And now caught looking. That's a perfecter. Can't do much about that one, Francisco. Australia able to punch out Dickerson. This time catches him looking, so he strikes out the side in order. His season with the Red Sox is officially over. Popped up on the infield, Mercer, or Kramer, it's Kramer. And the walk doesn't hurt. Archer turns out to be an eight pitch inning. On Archer. And he lines it toward right center field. How about Chris Archer? He's got extra bases. In the second with a double, little stutter step around the bag. He loves it. Yeah. So does his buddy, Terrell Edmonds. Kind of quiet. Drive to right, and over is Sierra to make the catch. He's had three pretty good at bats. really really well and last night he made another appearance I believe Greg if we get a hit right down the left field line but he made another appearance last night uh, to raise funds for the late Bruno San Martino at a local appearance I believe right 
right down the middle. Not a strikeout candidate, but uh, to left, deep, Dickerson, wall, and gone to give the Marlins the lead. On a 2-0 pitch, Lewis Brinson hits his 11th of the year, and it's 3-2 Marlins. And he gets the strikeout, but he gives up the three-run homer and a very costly walk. And he lines it off this lefty in the right center. And he's thinking two. And he's going to get there. He's okay. He went in hard, a high dive. Now they're going to get him out of there. Gets him. Strikes out Frazier. No, Michael McHenry will hold the fort. <laughs> and down on strikes, another <laughs> outstanding inning from Richard Rodriguez. Pirates. And up the middle, how about your first big league ribby? Ties the game. Kramer. Singles to center. Luplo puts a charge into one, deep to right center field, approaching the wall, and the loop goes deep. You gotta love the loop. He just gave the Bucks the lead with an opposite field home run. Jordan Luplo's third. Five, three, Buckos. Pass the right side. A little late toss by Bell, but the out is recorded at first. Not pretty. Almost like he jammed or twisted a knee. There's a strike three called, and Felipe got a chance to uh, pick up save number 31, give the Pirates a four game winning streak if they can get three more outs. There. When Josh Bell comes in, they throw him a ball. Oh, go ahead. Strike three called, and that is the first out. To the right side, Frazier, and Frazier. Pirates have won four in a row. And within a game of the 500 mark. Yep, they uh, had a little lead, it got away, they got it back and didn't give it up. Some of the young Pirates contribute. Josh Bell, of course, ends that home run drought. Got the Bucks out in front. That home run in the second. Jordan Luplo's home run gave the Pirates the lead in the seventh.